Praise the Lord, brothers and sisters. Praise the Lord. What a privilege it is to share with you the supernatural word for the day. Today is Friday, 25th of June, 2021. I would love to thank my man of God, Pastor Dennis Amos Emerjong, and Mama Ann Emerjong for this opportunity to share with you the supernatural word for the day. That he gives us the theme which is prayer works. Prayer works. That he gives us this theme from the book of James, chapter 5 and verse 16, which says, Confess your trespasses to one another and pray for one another that you may be healed. The effective fervent prayer of a righteous man availeth much. Daddy tells us that sometimes you find Christians who say, I need powerful prayers. So please, pray a powerful prayer for me. But what's a powerful prayer anyway? What makes a prayer powerful? Is it the loudness of the voice of the one praying? Or is it because they are speaking religious words? Well, what you need isn't a powerful prayer, but a simple prayer to a powerful God. Hallelujah. What makes prayer work is faith and not the multitude or multiplicity of words. Jesus made this very clear in the book of Mark chapter 11 and verse 24. Therefore I say unto you, what things soever ye desire, when you pray believe that ye receive them and ye shall have them. Therefore make your, sim- make your prayers simple. Pray with faith and avoid vain repetitions. If prayers weren't working, God wouldn't have encouraged us to engage in this noble activity. God isn't a liar. Approach the throne of grace boldly. Refer to the book of Hebrews chapter 4 and verse 16. This means you must have confidence when you get into your closet and when you cry out to your father. Confidence that he answers you. Thankfully, you are righteousness of God in Christ Jesus, and God is very interested in hearing your your prayer. Through prayers, we have fellowship with the Father. With this in mind, make it a point to pray continuously and affectionately, and before long, you testify about the wonders of prayer. Hallelujah. Daddy gives us the meditation scriptures for the day, which is coming from the book of First John, chapter five and verse fourteen. Now this is the confidence that we have in Him, that if we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. And from the book of Psalms thirty-four and verse fifteen, the eyes of the Lord are on the righteous, and His ears are open to their cry. Praise the Lord. That gives us the prophetic declaration. Brothers and sisters, let us lift our holy hands and declare these words after me. I declare that my faith is effectual. Therefore, I effect necessary changes in my life. And circumstances by the power of the Holy Spirit and with the word. I am used of God to expand his righteousness in the world. I joyfully engage in prayer and supplication for my good and the good of the world around me. Hallelujah. Let us ponder on this word. Let us speak in tongues. O sile le le ba sota la ba kaya. Ma sile ke tele ba zile le bo shandali kaya ba sota la ba Father, we thank you for this word. We thank you for these words, O oh Lord. In Jesus' mighty name. That he gives us the one year Bible study plan which is coming from the book of Nehemiah, chapter 3 and chapter 4, and from the book of Proverbs, chapter 4. Shalom. Shalom.